It's brutal out there. That's what a Chicago police captain says about the carjacking crisis. To investigator Brad Edwards says 2017 could see up to 800 of these terrifying thefts. Here's Brad now. Carjacked at gunpoint. An attempted carjacking. This carjacking. Armed carjacking. These three men were Chicago carjacked victims this summer. Two lived to tell. Basically, you open up the door, boom. Ian Collins was pistol whipped after leaving a River North bar. And on the side of my head, gun. Gun. Rex Archambault met the business end of a pistol when he heard. Get out of the car, you white or I'm gonna blow your brains to the side of the window. These are words you don't forget. He's seen here moments later telling an employee of this Westtown wine shop to call 911. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm shooken up. I'm shooken up. Citywide, the number of carjackings has soared. Here's 2013, 14, and 15. Then in 16, a big jump. In 17, Chicago has notched 550 carjackings in the first eight months on pace to finish with more than 800. This increase is, is certainly one that's alarming. Criminal I, justice you know, professor I, Arthur Lurigio says I carjackings have spiked in part drugs. because. High end newer vehicles are almost theft proof. Unless you carjack it. Carjacking is the way to, to get the vehicle. An increasing number of sources say committed by juveniles looking for high-end rides and bolstered by street knowledge, police no longer chase. Arrests have come in a mere 34 of this year's 550 or 6%. Not only is it scary because it's unpredictable, it's also difficult to enforce because it can happen any time of the day, any street in Chicago. <laughs> That's when they told me that my son was dead. 28-year-old Jesus de la O lost his life in an attempted carjacking in August. The last time he spoke with his mom, she warned him to leave the city. You didn't want him living no, in Chicago? No. Why? Too much danger. Too much danger, she said. De La O's family is offering a $10,000 reward for information leading to his killer's arrest. In our three highlighted cases, all the cars were recovered. No one has been arrested, Rob and Erica. Oh, given how random these are, what can we really do to be vigilant in these situations? Well, sources tell me it's, it's really the crime du jour right mm. now. And surprisingly, some of the suspects are younger than 16, and they really can't almost give an entire unit up and set up a decoy vehicle, it, it, it just is kind of impossible to predict and they have to be just reactive. Wow. Okay. Brad, thank you. Yeah.